My name is Brian Cox, but most people know me as the travel vlogger. I'm always in search of extraordinary experiences, and on this adventure, I'll be biking over 700 kilometers across the Czech Republic. Come with me to see what makes this destination so special. Dobre rano and good morning from Lidomir Jitse. Today is day four. I'm starting to feel the legs, but last night got a great sleep. Today we had the absolute best breakfast that we've had the entire trip. We're gonna be riding all the way from here to Mielnik, which is gonna be about 50 kilometers. I'm not so sure what we're gonna see along the way, but come with me to find out. We were only on our bikes for a few kilometers before we arrived to the Terezin Fortress. The fortress was originally built under the Austrian-Hungarian Empire to protect against Prussian invasions. We wandered around the fortress, learning about its history, and just as we were leaving, something special happened. So right about now, you're probably wondering, what am I doing holding this 18th century gun? Well, somehow I convinced them to let me fire this bad boy. So let's see what kind of trouble we can get into. Three, two, one. <laughs> oh man, that was awesome! <laughs> oh, I love this country! For what was surely the high point of the day, next would be the low point. It was time to say goodbye to our first rider of the trip. So we were able to get three and a half days out of Jiri, rode us around, showed us a ton of great stuff. I can't thank you enough. Thanks so much guys. Yeah, thanks so much. Thanks for following along, safe travels, and see you soon in the Czech Republic. Now we would ride across the town to a small part of the fortress that became a Nazi concentration camp during World War II. Today, it's a Holocaust memorial. And now Yannick would be leaving us. Have a nice time in Czech Republic and don't remember Oshli Hotel. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you for everything. Bye. And we're down to three. With only three of us left, we started making our way to our next stop, Rudnice nad Labem, following along the Labe River for over 19 kilometers. We arrived and stopped at a cafe for lunch. All right, Mikhail, what did we order? What am I eating here? I ordered for you the special beef with a sauce from the leaf and the traditional Czech dumplings. Nice. And what is this? That free kind of dumpling and sour. You want some? You should try it. Ah. After lunch, we briefly visited the town's castle that belonged to one of the oldest Bohemian noble families, the House of Lobkowitz. And this is where Mikhail would leave us. So basically we have 26 kilometers left until our end point of today to Mjelnik. I've been told we need to take the number two all the way. So we'll be looking for this sign. This was the last biking of the day and it was a beautiful ride along the river. Tons of time to reflect on our trip thus far. It was not long before the beautiful town of Mjelnik was upon us. We had one final hill to overcome. All right, we just got to Mjelnik. We put the bikes in the locker. We checked in to the hotel. We're gonna take a quick shower and then we're gonna take a tour around the city. So come on. Now it was time to explore. We walked around the main square and around the historic center. Next, we would go into a wine cellar to try some regional wines with some local ladies. There was a language barrier, but nothing a few glasses of wine could not solve. In no time, we were old friends. Okay, I'll have one more glass. And finally, we ate a quick dinner. 
Unfortunately, this is the time where we end the video tonight. I wish I could stay so much longer, but I'm super tired from the huge journey, but it was great to meet some Kochki, have some great wine, delicious food. For more information on what we did today, check out the links below. Good night. On day five, we leave Mjolnik, stop to see a Baroque chateau, and arrive to Prague. To see tons of great photos from the journey, or to post your own shots, be sure to check out these hashtags on Instagram. Don't leave yet. There's tons of great videos to keep watching. More importantly, did you subscribe yet?